After 95 years, No Jane Brothers Supermarket is still a staple of Syracuse's west side. Well, it means a lot to me. I've been here for years. My dad always came here since I was a kid, so it's great coming here, actually. They're wonderful people here. It's family run. That's what, that's what makes it nice, that it's family run. And it isn't just nostalgia that wins customers over on the west side. Here, No James serves as an oasis of fresh produce in a neighborhood that would otherwise become a part of Syracuse's urban food desert. It's right by my house, and I don't send me have to go away and rest the lights and stuff. I could just come right here. There's fresh produce and fresh meats. Um, other stores like Western Lights and Wegmans are a little further out of the area, so it's nice to have it close in the neighborhood. After a $2.65 million renovation project, Syracuse's oldest grocery store is on the eve of a grand unveiling of upgrades and increased focus on fresh food and healthy living. No James wanted to make an emphasis on healthy eating, a major part of this renovation. And to do that, they've expanded their produce section, moved it to the front of the store, and sprinkled helpful signs like these among fruits and veggies to emphasize nutritional values. We need to see the fruit and vegetable area first anyway because it'll make sure that shoppers will stop here and look. Yeah. They're just not going to go buy it. If they have a cart, they're going to, it's actually reaching out for customer eyes to get, see. Though No James is in full operation now, they plan to host a neighborhood reopening party tomorrow at 2 p.m. Reporting from the West Side, I'm Kelly Cowan.